Bear Canal fire investigators in New York City are on the scene of the city's deadliest residential fire in more than 25 years, trying to determine how it started. Last night's fire in the Bronx killed a dozen people, including four children, and injured several others. Laura Podesta has the latest. Investigators believe a child playing with a stove caused the fast-moving fire that broke out just before 7 Thursday night, killing 12 people and sending four others to the hospital in critical condition. A young boy, three and a half years old, playing with the burners on the stove. Uh, the fire got started. The mother was not aware of it, was alerted by the young man screaming. She exited her apartment with these, uh, her two-year-old and three-year-old and left the door open. People trapped, uh, apartment 13, we're getting a baby in there. Uh, also apartment six, people trapped. Fire crews arrived on the scene three minutes after the first 911 call. This building resident said he relied on his faith while he waited on his third floor fire escape. The fire service people bring that, brought a ladder and they took the children one out after the other, including my wife and myself. Fire officials say the building had at least six open building code violations, including a broken smoke detector on the first floor where the fire started. Survivors were forced into the bitter cold with no warning. It was like freezing point, so it was worse for people who wasn't ready and dressed appropriately with no shoes or any of that. The Red Cross responded with blankets and moved survivors to a nearby school. The mayor is calling the fire the worst fire tragedy the city has seen in at least a quarter century. Laura Podesta, CBS News, The Bronx, New York.